The mercury is rising, and with the temperatures in the 80s and now perhaps the 90s, it's feeling a lot more like summer, but the added heat can come with some dangers. Fox 11's Alex Ronaldo has more on how to stay safe when you're out and about. With a cool week behind us, Monday's heat was a little shock to the system. This is the kind of weather that our bodies take a little bit more time to adapt to. It can be tough for people to stay active outside. Leah Shapiro with Fleet Feet Fox Valley says you should still get out there, especially if you're training for a race. Inevitably, the race day could be this hot, and so you don't want to avoid it completely. But feel free to take it a little easy. Take a couple extra walk breaks. Um, to wear things like a visor to just keep the sun out of your eyes. It's amazing how much energy you can expend just squinting. And drink plenty of water before, during, and after your workout. It's critical. A lot of people demand too much from their bodies, and that's where, you know, even a little bit of dehydration can wreak havoc on the muscles. Listen to your body. I mean, if, you know, you're starting to feel overly fatigued, just go pull under a tree for a little bit and, and take it easy. Nikki Galhar with Chain Reaction Cyclery says it's a good idea to run or ride with a buddy, or at least tell someone you're going and bring a cell phone. Just to let them know perhaps just a rough route where you're going is always a really good idea. Shapiro says the same rules apply to children. If you see their, their skin really flushed and their body temperature is not coming down quickly, um, then pull them into the shade and let them just relax a little bit. Gelhar says it may be hot, but that's what summer is all about. It's nice after all the cool weather we had, so yeah, it's nice. It's welcomed. In Appleton, Alex Ranallo, Fox 11 News.